Now, what are some of the damages that could happen to your hair when you have high blood pressure? When you have high blood pressure, your body is under a lot of stress physically and mentally. That means your sympathetic nervous system will be activated. When the sympathetic nervous system is activated, you have higher blood pressure. But then you would also have a decrease in blood flow towards your skin. And that's where the hair lives. Your hair follicles contain some of the fastest growing cells in your body. And if the blood flow is going away from the skin, the, the hair follicles cannot survive, so they die. And that's when your hair fall off. Let's try some example. Pregnant ladies. When you are pregnant, your body is under a lot of stress, both physically and mentally. Your blood pressure goes up, but then you have less blood going to your skin. So a lot of women will say that their hair will thin out. Their hair will drop off a lot more than usual. See, after they have the baby, and the stress level, levels goes down, the hair starts to grow back. So what are some of the changes that occur to people's hair when they have high blood pressure? If someone is bald and they have high blood pressure, it's not going to get better. The skin will get drier and drier and, get, and less blood supply and the hair will start to fall out gradually and it will get worse and worse as time goes by. If you're a woman, you are more, a bit more fortunate, but because there is less blood supply going to the skin, the hair follicles cannot survive. So you will start to have more and more hair falling off. Even your eyebrows, sometimes they can thin out as well. As the disease progress, your hair will gradually get thinner. Another area where you would have a lot of hair loss would be down your legs. The circulation going down towards the leg will be a lot restricted when you have high blood pressure. If you have a lot of hair when you are young, if you have high blood pressure, as the disease progresses, you will see that the hair in the legs will gradually thin out. Normally when I see a patient, I can tell how healthy their skin is by looking at how much hair they have on their leg. If a person is having a lot of hair in their leg and the skin looks good, that means they are pretty healthy. Uh, so that are some of the damages that could happen to your hair when you have high blood pressure.